Hey everyone, welcome to Beach Investing. I'm your host, Andre Angelkowski. We're here in Atoko. We're in the prime beaches in Toronto, and we're about to look at the most ideal beach property. Hey everyone, welcome to Beach Investing. I'm your host, Andre Angelkowski. We're here in Atoko, and again with Lucas. How are you, buddy? Good, how are you? Good. So, you cannot recognize this house behind us because it looks completely different. Last time you saw it, it was on stilts. It was being lifted up so you can dig out the entirely new basement that did not exist before. And now it looks like you bricked it, you put a normal driveway in, and there's a basement. Yeah. So, like, this is the progress video, but it's well on its way to almost being complete. Yeah, another couple of months. Another couple of months, and you're creating the triplex. So, uh, it looks phenomenal from the outside and uh, I'd love to see what it looks like on the inside. Where do you want to start? In the basement? Yeah, it's on the basement. Let's go on the basement. Basically, all this concrete is what you put in to yeah. create the new basement. Yeah. Brand new foundation. Driveway is all new. Yeah. And this takes you all the way to the back. All the way to the back. Just so you know, a year ago when we were actually here, it was the stays of the year. And today we chose this the next coldest day because it's freezing a year later and then you know it took people a year to do this yeah so, it started in january yeah and you have separate decks for everyone in the basement the walk out from there and this is your entire backyard which you're going to create uh, some storage space yeah. for the tenants and uh tell, tell us that you needed this for uh yeah soft, soft scaping soft scaping yeah we have a certain amount of percentage so we figured we use this turf stone um, and yeah, it's considered uh, soft scape and yeah, our cards are off. Okay, let's go to the basement. Yeah. So we're coming down to the basement apartment here. And when you uh, come in, the first thing I, I notice is the floors. Yeah. They're, uh, they're, what do you call it? It's like uh, polished concrete? Polished concrete, that's right. And uh, is this the actual finished product right now? No, that's it. But it'll be cleaned up and stuff. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Heat wise, is there? No, no. It's just the central area. Right? Central area, yeah. Okay, so you have you come in here, you walk into this actually pretty nice kitchen already, um, and your living area. Yeah. And again, you sus you suspended your furnace. Yeah. I suspended the furnace for a couple of reasons. I guess you could put storage in there. Unless we're having a hot water tank that's going in there and an HRV that's going in there, so we got have to utilize it to the best of our ability, right? And look at the size of the windows. Yeah, egress windows. So a body could fit in there. So we get some more light in here too. Yeah, it doesn't actually feel like a basement at all. No. High ceilings, it's over like eight feet. Yeah. So this is this is the basement that did not exist. So <laughs> basement. This is the basement. So this is this is this is like the you know we you lived in the house. Yeah. You dug up this basement and now it's living space. Yeah. Alright, let's go uh, see what else we have here. So we got a bedroom here, again, massive windows. Yeah. Um, that's going to make it feel very, very spacious, yeah. natural light. Good sized bedroom. And you got a big closet here too. Yeah. Uh, regarding the floors, Lucas, uh, you know, I I'm noticing like stuff like this. I don't know if that was uh, a crack. No, but, it's just, it's, you know, or maybe it's just dirt. Yeah. Oh, okay, you're right. It is. It's not a crack. No, oh, it's not a crack. Also, like, there's a hole here. I guess you know, something probably fell. But yeah, I get the guy back here once the thing. He seals it and he doesn't go over on the Okay, so like maintenance yeah. on this stuff. Like, it's, if anything happens, it's fixable. Yeah, it's fixable. Yeah, yeah 100. Okay. Oh, you have pocket doors. Yeah, so there's a pocket door here, yeah. Okay. That's just for the bathroom, I guess? That's just the bathroom. Uh, okay. And finally, the uh, the last bedroom here. Uh, so tell us what you have. Uh, so basically down here is a sump pump, right? So there's weeping tile all around the house and it comes step back to here and then it pumps it out once it fills up. Uh, and this is your uh, sanitary pump, basically. The sewage ejector? The sewage ejector, yeah. yeah. 
Um, so anything from the basement, right? Because the uh, the uh, the drain is actually higher from the city, higher than it was. Eh? Yeah. So that's why you got have, have to put that in. It, I mean, it was just slightly higher. Yeah. A couple of, like a couple of inches, right? Really? Yeah. So you have to put one of these in, and this is going to be inside a closet, so it's going to be kind of. Uh, you know, hidden in hidden as, yeah, as much as possible. Okay. Okay, so let's go uh, see upstairs. Yeah. Okay, so you enter from the backyard yeah. for this unit, and uh, we step into the open concept kitchen and living room. Yeah. A little small, yeah. but still compact and definitely yeah. livable. Yeah. Terrible yeah. condos. And uh, to your left here is the laundry. Yeah. And then, uh, which is nice to see. Yeah, it's washer dryer, stackable. And then the, the kind of behind you is for when you enter, it's your uh, barrel closet for your, your shoes and your jackets when you walk in. Okay, that's uh, let's see what else the apartment has. Number one. And I like how all the apartments are going to have their own uh, electrical panel. That's important. Then in the bathroom, you have your furnace room there? Yeah, it's like a little furnace room, um, storage. That's where you know, I put stuff in there. So where's the furnace? The furnace is up here actually. It's got kind of a little hole in there. I don't know. No, but um, access panel. Access panel. So you suspended it. Yeah. Similar to the basement, but this is actually the ceiling. Yeah, this is actually goes um, goes horizontal. Is it, is it a specific furnace for that, or you can do any furnace for that? No, it's, it's a specific one. Really? Okay, well, you definitely. Well, it's the same one as over there, you just change the position on it. Yeah. It's worth perfect. Okay. So. And a single sink toilet? Yeah, toilet, sink. I can't really see the floor, but what kind of floors do you have here? Uh, it's just, I think it's porcelain. Oh, the tiles. Tiles. Yeah, I wouldn't know. Oh, here, engineering. Yeah. Engineering. Okay. Engineering. Yeah. And finally, the last bedroom here. Yeah, so this is, this is another bedroom. This window, the massive window. Yeah. And here, you have a double closet. Yeah. Now this is not going to exist. You know, this is going to be closed off. Now uh, they don't need, once the permits are closed, you'll be able to close it off and have it its own contained apartment. Yeah. Okay, so the entrance to the, the upstairs is from the front door, and you go up. Okay. I like the way this looks. Kitchen's going in there? No, right there. Wow, I thought it was there. Okay, cool. Kitchen, fridge, yeah, kitchen all the way through. Yeah. Up to probably like somewhere where there. So you've got enough room so you can walk through here. Pretty much. So it'll be something like that. And then the rest of the space will be for your yeah. family. Yeah. And you have your own balcony. Yeah. Beautiful view. Are they, are they building anything there? Yeah, yeah, I think they're going to be building a whole bunch of like tile houses and houses, man. They were just destroying it, whatever was there. They destroyed it this summer and I think there's a sign there, it's going to be like houses. That's a good sign for you. You'll have a good grip on that. Yeah. This is uh, actually a pretty interesting bedroom. So we actually changed it up. There used to be a wall that went here for whatever reason. And I kind of made it a little bit out because just the right. hallway was way too big, right? So I figured maybe put a bed here and I think there's like more than enough room here, right? I would have assumed if you did have the wall like this, the other side would have maybe had laundry, stacked laundry, or not stacked side by side laundry. Where's your laundry room? It's right in here. So right here you have your, again, furnace. compact furnace. Wow, everything's in there. You really thought? We have the thought into where these things go. And your laundry is going to be stacked right there yeah. inside it. Yeah, 
with obviously doors here, right? We're gonna use the same doors as we do for the kitchen. for the kitchen. Okay. So it looks nice. You know? Yep. And what's in there? Uh, that's that's a bathroom. So the reason we have all these arches is because we have to keep the front of the house 10 feet. You have to keep the house front of the house what? We have to keep the front of the house yeah. right 10 feet. What does that mean 10 feet? It's 10 feet, like from here it's 10, 10 feet, we couldn't touch it. Oh. And this is the peak of the roof. I see. Right? Remember how it used to be one and a half? Remember, it used to go like this, all of them, like the whole oh, story? Yes, yes, yes. So this is it. Right? And then we kind of like, I have a whole bunch of ducks here and stuff like that, that feed like, like you can see two vents here, and then there's another two vents that come down there, and another, another vent that goes down there. Okay, so this is, so this is basically another bedroom. Yeah, so two bedrooms. This might be your apartment that you might Possibly, yeah, maybe? yeah, possibly. Maybe, yeah. Make this maybe my little office. Yeah. Yeah. Well, it, it, it's it's a it's it's turning out to be actually very nice. Yeah. Um, we jumped from the last video that we did was pretty much all construction, digging out the basement. Yeah. To now where we are right now. Yeah. And I actually look forward to seeing the final reveal when all the kittens are installed, yeah. the bathrooms are showing yeah. as they should, and maybe uh, you'll be having a few couple of the apartments rented by them. Yeah, hopefully. What was the biggest sort of so far the, the I guess the what, that you went over budget yes yeah. you know the underpinning or not the underpinning digging the basement um, you know kind of digging took, right? yeah it took a toll on the you know on the bank over there yeah um, we added some you know a little bit more stuff like concrete concrete to the side landscaping was a little it was a little bit big on the on the budget yeah that time right the landscaping actually looked really nice so um yeah besides that everything's Kind of what, kind of what, the way that we want it to go. Okay. Uh, look forward to seeing the, the final reveal. Yeah. Thanks.